A motto for your life. In English class, Mr. Cole wrote a sentence on the board. No sweat, no sweet. What does it mean, Mr. Cole? It means if you don't work hard, you can't achieve your goal. It's my motto. It helps me lead a good life. After the class, Hajin asked his friends about their mottos. No humor, no happiness is my motto. Enjoy every minute. That's my motto. Mine is know yourself. Love the world, and the world will love you. Everyone had a nice motto. On his way back home, Hajin decided to have his own motto. However, he couldn't think of a good one. In the evening, he talked with his family. Today, my teacher told us about his motto. I want to have my own motto too. Good. It's helpful to have a motto. Do you have any good ideas? What about smile, smile, smile? That's not bad. But how about good to begin well, better to end well? What does that mean? It means it's very important to finish your work well. That's good. I think I need that motto. I often give up in the middle of doing something. How about you, Hajin? Do you like it too? Well, I don't know. I have an idea. The early bird catches the worm. How about that saying? I have heard it before. It means be diligent and you will succeed. That's right. It was your grandfather's motto. He was a diligent farmer. Which one do you like best? It's difficult for me to choose one. All of them sound great. What is the most important thing in life to you? Take your time to think about it. You'll find a motto. Okay, I'll think about it more. Thanks. Some people have mottos and others don't, but many great people in history had their own mottos and lived by them. Do you have a motto? If not, why don't you make one?